Hello everybody and in this video we will learn about the ABS formula. So let's understand what the ABS formula does. So the official statement of Microsoft Excel is that ABS formula returns the absolute value of a number that is a number without its sign. So it will be a neutral number without any positive or negative intonations. For example, let's understand this. We have a machine one, two, and three, and they're required to produce 150 units. And actually this one produced 120, this produced 90, and this produced 180 units, all right? Now the difference is 30, 60, and minus 30. Now why is it giving a minus 30? Because we are reducing, we are subtracting the actual from required. Now the actual was in fact more than what was required, all right? Now in your case, you only wanted to see what was the difference you didn't want to see the negative or the positive. So when you try to calculate the percentage, this pack percentage showed a negative sign with it. However, this one doesn't show that negative symbol, but it's the same formula. Why? Because we use the ABS formula to calculate it. And we use the ABS over here. Let me show you how. is equal to ABS, open the bracket, and then it says your number, so you can put a formula also, this minus this, all right? And we close the bracket, and we get the answer. Now we can copy this, just do a control C, and drag it down, and you can copy the formula. So now, since there is this ABS mentioned over here, it is not showing the negative symbol and you can see your change percentage that there is a change percentage of 20, a deviation of 20%, 40% and 20%. So there's the deviation actually was supposed to be zero. So this is how you use a ABS formula. See you in the next video.